Hey guys, so today you and I are going to talk about your sister. So let's get into it. So the question in question was, Frederick, my sister thinks she's so great because she builds all her software from the bottom up with C. She calls me a noob when I use Ruby to build a tic-tac-toe game and says that I'll never have a good... I'll never have as good fundamentals as her. How do I tell her off? How should I respond? Well, I'm gonna be honest with you. Your sister sounds like a bitch. But that's okay, since she's working in C, she's gonna fit right in with the other C developers. But uh, if you want to tell this person off, I would like just to would just like to point out immediately that uh, her future is pretty much written in stone if she's a C developer, because quote unquote fundamentals doesn't matter for shit if you want to work in web. So unless she's gonna, she wants to be a con like a contributor on the Linux kernel or working in embedded system for her entire career, you're gonna have the upper hand every single day of the week. Building a tic-tac-toe game in Ruby is a, f a whole lot more valuable if you want to go into web than knowing how to build things in C. C is a very, very useful language to know about and it's great to have these fundamentals, but I can, I can tell you right now, the vast majority of people who work in web, they, have ne like they haven't even touched C. Because it's pointless. It literally is pointless. Even if I think that you should learn, it because it's going to give you a really good understanding of how pro how programming works at a much lower level and how basically the computer works and memory and all of this stuff. That's really really useful. But this is at the best a supplement to core web skills. And I can tell you that if she wants to build things from the bottom up in C, she's going to have to just sit there on the forums with all the other C nerds and not get anything w meaningful done. Well, uh, they will get meaningful things done, but I mean, nobody has any, like, the, it's really just self-masturbation for most of the people who are building these, like, you're building something from the bottom up that people have already created a hundred times before, and they're doing it better than you could ever possibly want to be able to, and the entire industry depends on a layer that is above yours, so you're really only satisfying yourself at this point. Uh, and it has no practical value apart from the learnings that you will take uh, make. And as I said, if her ambition, which is highly likely, unless she really does want to be a system levels developer, they, she, then she's going to go have to build things. Well, I'm not saying specifically in Ruby here, but she's going to have to go um, uh, up, up a level. And so you're already ahead because the only thing that she's going to learn from C that you're not going to learn from Ruby, I mean, it's at best something that, I mean, you can reverse this thing. You can learn some basic C and get enough knowledge to have an understanding of how the whole thing works. Mastering C for a web developer is practically pointless. So, I mean, uh, this sounds to me like someone, as I was saying, like she can just join the forums with all the other people who, see, who can continue saying that C is the only language worth knowing when the vast majority of the industry has left them far behind and you can spend all your all day just agreeing with each other and talking about how everybody is stupid while the rest of the world moves on. So what I want you to take away from this is that C is a very, very useful language and I think that you should learn it, but I think that it's kind of weird to have the, that mindset. It's the same mindset that the C++ -plusers have. Just because you're lower level doesn't mean that you're doing something that is more useful. It's just that you're using, like, I mean, even, I would even say it's borderline stupidity to claim uh, to, to build or re basically recreate the wheel. Because if you're going with C, you're going to have to build layers and layers and layers of stuff that you, in order to get to the same abstraction levels and the same tooling as you will in Ruby. So unless there is a really good reason for you to do that, well then you're not going to be able to do any web. It's going to be pointless to you. And although, as I said, it's a very good supplement to your knowledge, uh, knowledge if, but as a, even as a web developer, it's far from the most important thing. There's so much more that is a, a lot more important to you if you're going to do web than C. So just tell your sister, Are you? do you want to hang out in a sweaty workshop with a bunch of middle-aged dudes who don't do anything but uh, sit on C forums all day? Because that's going to be your life, very likely, if you go continue the, down this route.
Bye-bye.